We are back on WCW Worldwide along with Bobby the Brain Heat, and I am Tony Schiavone. Still to come, a look at the Great American Bash, the next big pay-per-view coming up on the 18th of June from Dayton, Ohio in the Hair Arena. And, of course, the big main event has been signed, and the only thing I can say is that I would not want to be in Ric Flair's shoes. He has always been the man to say, I'm after you. I'm after Hogan. I want to get you in the ring. But there's one man who wants to get Ric Flair in the ring right now. You saw at the top of the program why, and he is the macho man Randy Savage. Well, this is a completely different situation. Savage has nothing to win, nothing to gain, no titles. The money doesn't mean anything, whether it's in the ring or wherever it is. He wants to get his hands on Ric Flair for beating up his father. He should go beat up his father. His father would have stayed in the seat his father would have kept him from getting his butt kicked because Flair's going to take care of the Macho Man. The Ayala brothers, Ray and Armando, to face Bunkhouse Buck and Dirty Dick Slater in this matchup here on WCW Worldwide from the world-famous Disney MGM Studios and, of course, the now world-famous Worldwide Arena. They don't come much tougher than Dick Slater You're right Bunkhouse about, Buck. You're right about that. We'll be going to Mean Gene in the Great American Bash Control Center. Side headlock takeover. Now you know you, Savage hasn't slept for days. All he's been thinking about for weeks is what happened to his father. To watch his father physically manhandled by Aaron Anderson and Ric Flair, he can't live with it. He has to avenge this for his family. Well, maybe they wanted him to do that. Maybe they wanted him to make a mistake, because that's what's going to happen. Side headlock cranked down by Dirty Dick Slater, and now... Bunk, speaking of dirty, Bunk House Buck coming in. This man will fight you anytime, any place, anywhere. That's a nice attribute. Works for him. And he's from Bucksburg, Tennessee, and he takes down Ray Ayala. Garden capital of the world. But Bucks know this? But Buck told me. Buck told you that? Yeah, last year they had two blades of grass over in the park. <laughs> really getting nice there now. I'm sure it's growing. What could be going through Macho Man's mind? He's got to be beside himself. What if somebody worked over your dead? How would you feel? You know, I'd feel pretty badly. But, you know, I'm not the macho man Randy Savage. I don't have that temper. I don't have that explosive personality. Whoa. Tell you, Armando didn't even get in. Ray Ayala is down, courtesy of Bunkhouse Buck and Dirty Dick Slater. This is a tough team, Shalani. Bunkhouse Buck and Dirty Dick Slater with the Colonel. Did you ever look at Parker's ring that Elvis gave him? No. A great looking ring. You yeah. believe, you believe Why would he lie to me? Well, Bunkhouse didn't lie to Halala. He just dropped him like a bad habit. Slater, too. Just pound at him. Just pound him. Come and have a look at the Great American Mansion more on Worldwide. Stay with us. <laughs> 